What's up, it's Rick Clark. It's your boy, DYS Gamer. And we're back with some more Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel. Last time we were playing. I can do this. <sighs> what happened? We did the Rounding Sheep quest and the Teaching Kids quest. Or Teaching the Kids quest. We also started the Cameraman Caravan or Cameraman Caravan quest, and we're about to finish that up. Apparently, someone decided to vacuum today. No, that's the hallway or downstairs. I'm guessing by the sound of it, probably either the hallway. I think this is like a 30 minute episode. Yeah! We're gonna open chests. We're gonna we're gonna grind some must just to stall for time. Maybe about ten minutes. Ten minutes of just grinding monsters. And after that, we'll be able to. Uh, that you are, I'm gonna fight you. Well, shall we begin? Here we go. After you know, just stalling for time for about ten minutes. And then opening chests for probably another three or four. We'll move on and I'll do army cutter. Leave it to me. Whirlwind to me! I can do this. Do my flame burning. Turn to flame! Burn! Yeah! Detect. Analyzing the enemy's vitals. All complete! Shoot this shell, white beast flesh, leak the water. Here we go. Great. That's real great. I got frost dead, so that's not gonna work. I can I'll leak cut her again. There. It's my turn. And then arts, hydro cannon. Right. Making the time, arts. Dark matter. Let's go. Right about here. Huh. <laughs> yeah. Is everyone okay? Yeah. That was a minute, 11 minutes. One minute, 11 seconds. Yeah. There we go. That sounds a lot better than a minute, 11 minutes. I don't know what the fuck I was trying to yeah. say there, but it came out hella wrong. Now's our chance. Go. I'm just gonna keep right. fucking yeah. these pieces up. Right. Okay, yeah! I can do this. Give me a suit. Go. Little bitch. It's my turn. Who's there? Together, we're unbeatable. Yes, unbeatable. Ten seconds. Hmm. Now, a lot of you yeah. are running while I have turbo mode on, right? The answer to that question is very simple. It's very simple. Whoa, whoa! Now's our chance. Here we go. But oh, yeah, I can't get all four. There you go. I got all, it's my all turn. five. Turbulent. Am I gonna hit? Who am I gonna hit? But 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 but. Make the fish, all the fish. Whirlwind to me! Right! Holding rain. Oh, no. I'm gonna make it rain. It's my turn! And Ethereal Edge. Let go! Off it off. Rush. Gaius! Rush! Yeah. My turn! See the way she says it. Gaius! Uses! It's my turn! I don't know what she just has such Leave a... Leave it to me. Who's there? Say <laughs> go where the wind takes me. Lady Saint! The Saintus is coming! The Saintus is I'm I'm I am i am i am telling you. Alright, if I just finish stuttering, I'm telling you. The wind's behind us. There's something go, about go. Emma, alright. And now I'm thinking about her like special, like her supercraft that we haven't got yet. 
and how she summons like some like five or six cathedrals to nuke the battlefield, which is still so epic. Can't wait till I get that shit. Hey, me. Take 30, you say? Give me like 30 more minutes, boy. Around 9 o'clock, we'll go out. Okay? Now, go. Oh, my bit. Oh, flame slash. Nice flame slash. Nice flame slash, you three. Flames, you scabble on my path. I can do this. Your motion rain. Oh, no. It's motion rain. Go! It's my turn. And then I can slam the hawk. That's precious. There you go. We should hurry. Overkill, split, sure, first strike. Yes. Ooh, level. Ooh, ammo level 30. Use is level 30. Wait, hold it. Where are they all level 30? Making progress. Yeah, Emma. <laughs> A matter use. of course. Level 30s, level 30s. Everybody in my crew, level 30. Oof. Everybody in my crew, yeah. level 30. The tortoise, I think we've already fought your kind before. Now's our chance, I can I do this. We got another four minutes to kill. My turn! <laughs> Alright! Okay! Analyzing the enemy's vitals. All complete! Uh huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. I can do this. Okay. Dark Max. My turn! The Monic side. <laughs> it's my turn. Hydro. Ooh. Yep. Uh, huh. Huh. That's that. Let's keep moving. Nope. I got that hydro off. That would've been perfect. But well, maybe which actually for mint sports. Sports. Yep. No. These the wolves. Wins. Give us your blessing. These must be the wolves. Right. Turn to flame. Burn. It's my turn. We're open. Come on. Yeah. Attack. Analyzing the enemy's vitals. I've got it. Uh -huh. All right. Let me see here. Art. Uh, you don't got no fire. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> that was easy. <laughs> Thanks to you, at least. Yeah. See. No, no, man. Guys, is just get sport about shit. The other niggas just can't hope to be. Yeah. Surprise me. No, you don't got breath. You got breath. And you haven't used any of it, so yeah. Do us up. Nothing to do with you. Well, actually, that's incorrect. That looks like a strong one. Be careful. And it is. We're not ready for it. It's 
not yet. He's not yet. Yeah. They turn Now's back to face chance. me. My turn. Single advantage. Leave it to me. Wow. Wow. That's precious. We should hurry. They get such good EXP. Like, the little dragon dude are my go to grinders right now. Yeah. They're just too good. They're just too good. Uh. I gotta grind up, uh. What's the word? Yeah. Yeah, I gotta grind up physical shit. Here we go! Attack. It's my turn! Let's keep on tapping. It's my turn! Right. Yeah. It's my turn! Here! Here we go! Yeah. I've got you! I can do this! Alright! There! Go! It's my turn! I can do this! Leave it to me. Who's there? My turn. Autumn leaf cutter. There. I can do this. It's my turn. Yeah. It's my turn. Who's there? My turn. Back smash. Let's keep moving. I forgot. I didn't look how many minutes I was. I don't even think I said that properly. Oh well. Yeah, everyone's pretty set. Uh, let's go. Pretty set. Yeah. Yep. Oh, that, we don't want to go that way yet. Oh, that's a whole other level. Whole other level. We're not trying oh, to do that. That's a beautiful that. looking treasure chest. Yes, yeah, beautiful. With its it's name. my turn. Molten rain, yep. Oh no, you got molten rain! Ah, here we go! Oh, nigga burning. Flash back like all these yellow. Oh, what you say? Leave it to me. Oh, you're right. You won't live no more. It's my turn! Point on. Point on. It's my turn. What am I going to do? Dark matter? Arcus Actus. Huh? I'm sorry. Ooh, green. Oh, all right. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Item. Oh, I don't got no reviving shit. Uh, let me see. Anything here revives? Okay. Nope. None. Oh, well. Yeah, I'm about to just make sure I survive. Yes, that was great. It's my turn. Me. Do that. It's my turn. I want to do this. I want to do blessed arrow. Blessed be we. Hang in there. Thanks. Thank you very much. <coughs> it's my turn. Privilege. This, this, this really is time. I can do this. Another blessed arrow. Yeah, it's turn it. It's turn it's on. Thank you, Greg. It's my turn. Oh, man, let's see your arts. I right, need silver thorn. Uh -huh. My turn. Arts. 
I can do Firebolt. Firebolt Heat Ray? Well, I did both of them for Heat Ray. Oh no. Frost Edge. Nope. Fuck it, I'm right side. Arcus, activate! Ooh, you just need fire? <laughs> Let's keep there we going. go. We, we overkilled them. That was... Oh, Rainy Soul 31? Perfect! Yeah, that's exactly what I needed. I did it! Serene to get level... Wait, what did I get? What item did they give me? It was something fire related. Harvest. That was earth related. Yeah, that's new post. There's harvest. Earth post, Lacress, Grand Press. Do art. Grand Press. What does that do? I know what Grand Press does. Why do I say that? Dragon Vein. Hmm. You want a chrono break? Dude, I don't even use it. I can get myself that. Or I can give that to you. Which would have been great, actually. But... Yeah, that would be great for you, because... With scent and harvest, earth pose. Let me see here. Earth, earth pose. Release healing. Heals thirty percent. Grand press. Localize earthquake. The press to play grants earth protection to raise defense as an area. Yeah, that would be. And what else does it give me? Oh, more HP. Ooh, nope, I need that. I need that HP. I mean, you already have more HP than me. What you need all that HP for? You don't. That's exactly. You don't need it. Kill yourself. Alright. Another chest? Any other chest? There is... Oh, we didn't get that one chest? Oh well, we gotta go get the other two. They are upstairs, alright. Yes. Not downstairs, definitely upstairs. That's what's happening. Because they just hit my door. Yes. Yes, yes. We gotta go downstairs, downstairs. Whoa, whoa! Damn it. We gotta go, no. Cutscene. Kind of looks evil. Like, he has that weird smile on his face. And, like, his eyes look like it's glaring down malevolently. Malevolently? With malicious intent. It looks like it's glaring at us. Yep. It kind of looks like it has a, uh, words. Words? I'm gonna finish it. Eh, fuck it. I don't care. It kind of looks like it has a rape face. Like, he's looking down like, all you niggas? They're about to get it. This is on a whole different level. I didn't read half that shit. Oh, that's that nigga right there. We found you. We she you. Oh, aren't you? Yeah. See you hard at work. You ain't pay your rent. I am we here to collect. As you come out here to get a good look at the statue, I don't think you realize how much worry he's caused everyone. We should we go back up to speed? Ugh. 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 Seems like I've caused unnecessary worry for the people of the settlement. We should get back right away, or rather, I'd like to, but I still have finished taking all the photography I need. Would you mind waiting a bit longer while I finish? 
Yep. Can't really fault you being fascinated. Really espresso. Have there seen anything like this anywhere else in the continent? Hold it. Shh. Shut up. You hear that? That background music changed. Oh man, it's more serene. This reminds me of a mystery dungeon song. From Pokemon Mystery Dungeon? I forget the name. It's like when you, uh. After you get ran away from being. Uh, from being a human. Or for revealing that you were once human, you get ran out the village. And maybe you know, you're going to. What was it? Moltres's uh, Mountain? Or the, uh. Kyrium's. Like frosty domain, like it happens so many times when you get chased off from being human. They're trying to like, man, when you niggas gonna learn? You need me. I'm the big boss around here. Anyway, it reminds me of a mystery dungeon, like sad. Huh, they hate me now, but don't worry, your companion is still with you. Friends to the end. Boom, 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 boom. That's what it reminds me of. Less like it's sending me down nostalgia. The river of nostalgia. And I don't want it to end. Anyway, actually, it might surprise you to know that there is. This isn't the only such statue I'm aware of. There's a similar statue on, Bry on Bryonia Island. Way out to the west. Wait, Brian Island, isn't that where Group B was sent? Huh, I had no idea there was more than... There are more of these around. No one knows more about the statue on Brianna Island than they do about this one. But I'm certainly taking pictures of ruins and ancient sites like this. Currently, not certainly. Taking photographs of the area was the reason I came to the North Highlands in the first place. Guys told us the people of the North refer to the statue as the guardian of the region. Yep, the old legend says that this statue was here long before ancestors came from the east. And that they settled to this land only with his permission. Mm. What I saw, I was really reminded of the legend of the great knight. You know, now that you mention it, I feel like I've heard that name somewhere before. No doubt, the till originated during the Dark Ages and it spread through the Empire when the land rose with tide. A colossal knight wreathed in flame will come from the will come forth to quell the conflict. That's the general gist of it anyway. What do you mean by that? Well, each region has its own variant of the tale. They all maintain a knight as a central figure, but like all such tales, each veracity is questionable at best. Though it's certainly one of the most mysterious legends passed down in the Empire. I see. It does seem like this statue could mesh with the story too. I wonder if they're related somehow. Huh! What was that? This evil power inside of me is awakening me! <laughs> I'm losing all control! Arrgh. I'm scratching. Are you okay? No! My chest! Feels like someone just shot me! With Cupid's arrow! Girl, you looking cute in that getup! Anyway, I've come all this way out here. Is that it? Does it turn out that Reem is a destined child to pilot the Machina? Anyway, I've come all the way out here, so would you mind waiting till I'm done taking the photos? Hurry up, I head back to Selman with you as soon as I'm done. What well, doesn't seem like the wildlife has much interest in this area. He should be safe on his own here for a while. Agreed. Go do something else. Yes. All right. We'll swing by again in a little while and check on you. Very well. Let's do our best. <laughs> let's go. On the horse. Yeah. Wait. 
mentioned Corey. Do we have to go over there for something? I think we did. I think we did. They're all places guys said we could go visit. My chest. Do you have my chest? Uh, oh my god, damn chest. chest. You know. yeah. Almost over here. None? Hippogriffs. They look more like Basilisk, to be honest with you. With that giant reptilian lizard tail. I can see those things being Basilisk. Hippogriffs. What's horse like about that creature? Yeah. This is. It's so gloomy in here. <clears throat> yeah, certainly is gloomy. So this is the ancient quarry. It looks like a burial site. The atmosphere is really heavy. I'm guessing this is the ancient quarry. Yeah, sure is. That uh, they say it dates all the way back to the Neolithic civilization that was here over a thousand years ago. Those are the same legends that say the guardians sealed away an evil jinn. I do recall bringing someone back to some mentioning a jinn. This is a bit unsettling. Plenty of folks think so too. I think most of the people, the highlands, avoid the area, though. I can't see it bothers me all that much. It does seem like a place straight out of the old tales of legends, though. There's no one around and not much reason for us to be here either. What should we do? If you're curious about me, it's gonna take a closer look. I've poked around here before, but I never really found anything interesting. Ah, nothing phases you, does it? All right, I suppose it could hurt to check it out. Yeah! Are there any monsters? I only came here to grind. But there is a treasure chest. How do we get there, though? That's yeah. my question. You know, we have to come here for something. Something's gonna have us have to come in here, <laughs> go through the ruins. There appears to be reached a dead end. There's no one either. There's a stone door that I don't think even a combined might can open. It seems like it's a waste of time. Here. <laughs> I suppose you might be right. Though it does seem like the kind of place an evil spirit might hunt. This whole area really, it has an eerie vibe I just can't shake. What? You could sense that kind of thing? Yep, see? I'm telling you. She's like a holy daughter or, or a saint of some kind, man. Oh, no, 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 no. That's just the impression I get from us looking around. Never mind that. Hmm? Hmm? What now? I doubt it's anything, but... I just thought I saw something moving out of the corner of my eye. Same here. Could be a small animal. Plenty of those around here, no doubt. It would scarcely surprise me to catch something less natural in a place like this. Hey, knock it off. She's afraid of ghosts. I'm trying to feel kind of creeped out now. Sorry. Anyway, there's not much we can do here, so let's just get going. Yep, she's afraid of ghosts. Whoa, whoa! That's why she had that look on her face. We're rather coming for something, because there's chests up there I need to get. We can't pay too much, I tell you. Whoa, whoa! I can do it. Stop running into shit, horse. Yeah! I'm looking backwards while riding, but... I mean, you can run into shit. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. I'm glad to be back here again. Agreed. Like really I'm certainly not yourself? afraid to return. Huh? Will any more information you have slip? Will you some of those fancy smashing magic tricks? Huh? 
You want to touch that statue that you is, Emma? Mm -hmm. Now then, which way do we go? Lake is this way, huh? Good place to grind. Do all that grinding off camera though, that's the sad part. But as much as I love grinding, everybody likes watching me just massacre and leave a race, race, species extinct. Someone living here? Wow, this lake is beautiful. It really is. You can see the sunlight glimmering on the water. And the air feels so clean, too. This is Lake Lacrima. I and others in the settlement come here every now and then. It seems like a quite a distance. It seems like, no, no. It seems like quite a distance to travel. Any particular reason for coming here? Sure is. You see that cabin over there? There's a hermit who moved in there about five years ago. He used to live in the Empire. He's a real whiz with orbital tech and anything mechanical, so he's been a real boon to use here. To us here. A hermit, huh? I can't say I don't I admire it too much, but if it meant you got to live somewhere, it's pretty sis. A hermit, huh? Well, I can't say I admire it too much if it meant I got to live somewhere as pretty as this. <laughs> you got that right. So you think he's in right now? Hard to tell from here. I like to drop by and say hello while I'm back in Nord though. Turns out it's Alyssa's father. Yeah. Or her older How brother beautiful. or her older sister. Yeah, breathtaking. That her mother refuses to mention. Man, I'd love to get in a little fishing here. Well, no one's stopping you. Go! Where is it? Ooh, this looks like a good spot. Right here. Right here. Where is a good spot? Oh, right here. Huh. Let's see what happens. It's a catch. Oh, this is rainbow trout. Yo. Huh. Fishing in breeze. Bitch. Not bad. A cast. One these before. Huh. One more. Another cosky, huh? Huh? Hmm. Bitch. Not bad. Okay. Ooh, this looks like a good spot. Let's take this bus. Somebody over here. Not gonna lie, the water looks a bit weird, but then again, it also looks good. So, 
Yeah, I don't know how I feel about it. It looks weird, but it feels good, so. This looks like a garage for an oval car. It's locked up, though. Huh. He usually leaves it unlocked so he can tear out of here on the whim and rove around the place. <laughs> he sounds like a very entertaining person. Hmm, seems he's out then. Still, we may as well check the cabin just to be sure. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, I really get the feeling that this is going to be Alyssa's father or, or brother. Going to shirk our responsibility and ran away. This is where the hermit lived. Glancing around this room, you could tell it was tell what his hobbies are. Yeah, he's always favored laid back life. It looks like there hasn't changed. He used to take me and my siblings fishing back when we were younger too. Uh -huh. It looks like he's living quite a comfortable life here. I know someone who has these exact same hobbies. I mean, what are the chances? Yep. Mm hmm Anyway, it looks like he's out right now. His boat's not at the wharf. So he must have gone out fishing. Well, you will have to come back and see him some other time. We want to see him. Looks that way. All right, let's get going. Yep, I told you. This is going to be Alyssa's father or her older brother. One of the two. Damn, this, this is tall. Leave it to me. Like, yeah, that's pretty high up there. It's my turn. Yeah. I've got this. It's my turn. It's my turn. Anyway. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. So we found out where Alyssa's father or brother ran the fuck off to. That's good. That's good. A lot of mysteries being solved. The only mystery that's not being solved is Emma. We'll come back there tomorrow. Tomorrow will be in the next part. After, you know, we start day two. That statue looks evil, alright? It doesn't look like it's actually supposed to be good. Kind of looks like Frieza's, was it first? No, second? Maybe, yeah, second form. Maybe that's where I might be. Alright. Yeah. Guiding Norton back to Selma will cause the store to advance. We're here for Norton to finish. We did everything we're supposed to do here. I mean. Okay, I'll try not to keep you waiting too long. Green and the others wait for Norton to finish his photography. And though he was reluctant to leave, even after depleting his photo courts, they finally returned to the settlement. Niggas be back. Whew. We're finally back in the settlement. Thanks to Miller for escorting me back here. Really appreciate it. Thanks to you, I was able to foot uh, I was able to take photos of the statue to my heart's desire. I'm just glad you made it back safe and sound, old man. Yeah, let's go tell the elder. Oh, there seems to be quite a commotion over there. What? That's... So who wrecked the car? Looks like there's been an orbital car accident. But why here? Is that the gentleman we fulfilled the request for this morning? Very same, so meant Dr. Amir. He wouldn't have been the one responsible, could he? Never mind that, we need to take a closer look. Amir, are you alright? Guys, I'm alright. Sorry for worrying you. What happened here? 
I was on my way back from gathering herbs in the mountain forest to the north. Then all of a sudden, I just lost control of the vehicle. Was anyone injured? I suffered a few bumps and bruises, but other than that, fortunately not. I'm just relieved I didn't end up hurting anyone. I'm glad you know your injuries. I'm glad to, <laughs> I'm glad to know your injuries are light. Thanks be to the winds and the goddess. So how does one lose control of a vehicle in the area that's open and free of... Uh, the area is open and free of obsta ob obstacles, obstructions, fuck it as this. Did you simply lose your, con uh, your concentration for a moment? No, of course not. This car is extremely important to all of us here. I wouldn't have dreamed of, uh, of driving it carelessly. I'm still not sure what caused it. When I was nearing the settlement, the steering wheel started to feel oddly stiff. Fortunately, the brakes were still functional, otherwise I'd have to think what might have happened. Hmm, I see. Alyssa? Let's see. I think you can work out with... Oh, Alyssa, do you think you can work out... Do you think you can work out what was wrong? Yeah, words. Probably. I think her father... has been tampering with shit here. Maybe her father's the one who... set the animals free. Her father's the one who tampered in the metal with the machinery. I might say it runs in the family. Uh huh, how can I forget? Is that the reason the, the psycho of the Ryanford group would be quite handy in, me in mechanical matters? Even if she does pretend she wants moving, she wants nothing to do with her family anymore. Because you mind your own business. What'd you say though? It's not a tr what you say, though, it's not as true as it used to be. They have some professional engineers at the Ralph Company now who can't even perform basic maintenance work. Well, standards in the higher education must be slipping. When you compare it to the Zest Central factory and the Liberal, the Ryan Ford Group is getting far too big for its own good. All those giant, vertically structured divisions, each with their own subdivisions. Sounds as though becoming the Empire's largest corporation brought its own share of new issues. Did they manage to figure out what the problem was? Hmm, I think so. Looks like there was a contact failure in the quartz circuit near the engine. That's probably why you suddenly had difficulty steering even though it was fine just before. I, I see. You think you can repair it? I doubt it. I can diagnose, but I'm, I'm no technician. I think we'll need to call in a professional to fix it. I suppose that means we'll have to ask someone from Zender Gate. I'm impressed. I can see that Thor's Academy is more to be proud of than just famous founder. Elder Ivan, that. I'm sorry it took us so long to get here. I'm relieved to see Nord made it back safely. Thank you for your assistance. Oh, no trouble at all. So you've been able to work out the cause of the problem here. Of all things, Alyssa. It was nothing. Hmm. There's no shame in being proud of your accomplishments. <sighs> well, I'm glad we've gotten this squared away. We still have something to be pr of a problem. What do you mean? This is sell mental only vehicle. Having it out of permission is going to make things pretty inconvenient around here. The sooner we can fix it, the better. I see. In that case, is there anything we can do to help? Uh, are you sure? This is part of your field study. I would respectfully disagree. If you treat us as such great food and show us hospitality, I want to do what I can to help. But actually, repairing the truck is a bit above my skill level. Still, it would be discontinuous, discourteous of us to not at least make an attempt to assist our host. Thank you, everyone. Uh, if you insist, we'd be more than grateful for any assistance you can provide. If you can bring out someone who could do the repairs, that would be great. That's one of the best course of actions. Should we go to Zendergate and see if they can spare a mechanic? That's the most of us. Someone far more keen than an army technician for things of this sort. Yeah, upgrade the lake. All right, so we go back to the lake. I'm sure he'll be able to fix the truck. True, the hermit could probably have this fixed in no time at all. He passed by earlier, but it seemed vacant. An old man from Empire who's more liable than an army technician. Could it really be him? So he wants to go and we'll call this man for you then. If you'd be so kind, there's no hurry though. Don't worry, I'll do it. Either way, all you need to sight by accident. Uh -huh. Yep, just handle it. Okay, got it. Let's go, guys. He 
got this. That's right, Liz. We're about to go meet your dad. That's right. We're about to go meet your daddy. We're about to meet the in-laws. We already met mother-in-law. It's time to meet father-in-law. Yeah. Or brother-in-law. Whoever the old man is. I mean, would you call your brother an old man? I mean, I could have, I could have called one of my brothers old man. But, can't say that no more. Breaking speeds. No, no, no. No, you don't. That's right. No, you don't. No. What do you want? No. Heathen! You're breaking the rules, mate. You're breaking the ironclad rules. What's up? Five more minutes. Guaranteed. See you at home. Yeah, the boat's back. Cars out in the open. But I say it's life excellent. We should go see him at once. You can hang yeah. back if you don't want to do this, Lisa. No one would have to know if you just hung out the front door. Out of slime, out of sight. Slime. Slime? Slime. Let's do this! That's my foot meat. Like someone's inside. I suppose it must be the man we came to see then. I bet he just came back from fishing. Hmm, for a hermit, he doesn't seem to want much, much. So, uh, what are we going to do? Yeah, knock on the door. Excuse me, is anyone home? Uh, it's open, come on in. Uh, now listen, excuse us then. That's her grandfather. Alright, fine. You wanna go see what the fuck niggas are up to? This floor my door was open. It's good to see you again, sir. Well, if it isn't Gaius, have you? I haven't seen you around for a while. What, half a year now? And little Alyssa's here, too. Well, I don't think I've seen your face in all must be coming on five years now. Wait, what? Could this be... Gr g grandfather? What are you doing here? I'm retired. <laughs> well, I guess that's one way to be introduced. But let me give you a proper welcome. The name's Gwyn. Gwyn Whiteford. Gwyn. <laughs> Whew. Reen? Gwyn? Okay. I'm Gwyn Whiteford. Elisa's favorite granddad. Pleasure to meet you all. Class 7. Honored to meet you, sir. I'm Reen. Reen Scrawzer. Reen Schwarzer. Uh, uh, honored to, to meet you, sir. Um, I'm, I'm Reen. Reen Schrauser. Schwarzer. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Emma Milstein. Yusuf Albrea. It's an honor. Ah, uh, promising group of young folks. If, I, if ever there was. So, but you've sure done a lot of growing in the last five years, Alyssa. You're taller and bigger. It does this old man's heart to good. Heart too good to see you. How easy on the eyes you've become. Mm. Grandfather, please. Don't forget about me. What have you been doing out here all this time? Back when you disappeared from war, I never have believed it. When someone told me this is where I'd find you. You have any idea how worried I've been? 
Oh, come now. I send you letters a couple times a year, don't I? And of course, I read all the ones you give to Sharon, too. Still, have you been here for the whole time? All these five years? All these five years. The whole time. The fuck am I doing? Just about. I don't stay year-round, though. I spend about half a year traveling around the continent, seeing friends or visiting the Empire. I see. Mr. Reinford. Reinford. Would you mind if I asked how you know so much about our field study? It was an excellent point. It's almost seems as though you were expecting us to pay you a visit. Uh, well, it's just a coincidence. The truck broke down when it did. But I admit, ever since Arena told me you were coming to the Highlands, I figured I'd see you at some point. Mm, yeah, she knew. She knows. I think it's her dad. Of course she's gonna know where her dad is. You still talk to Mother? You still talk to that bitch? <laughs> yes, indeed, though. Just the bare minimum. That girl's zeal for her work borders on unhealthy. What did I ever do to turn her into such a workaholic? You're probably just too laid back. That tends to be how it is. When you're a workaholic, your kids are laid back. And when you're laid back, your kids tend to be workaholics. That's just how it is, you know? Sure, you can probably instill in them, you know, your ways and mentality. But most likely, they're going to be the opposite. Hmm. Anyway, we're all done with our coffee, so let's head on over to the settlement and have a look at the truck. Just wait outside a bit while I go grab my tools. Oh, and actually, I caught a few good-sized trout. You can take them over to the settlement when you go. Of course. Hmm. Mm-hmm. So that's the former chairman of the Rhineford Company. I knew of him by name, but he's a far more lighthearted man than I would have guessed. Indeed, he seems very easygoing. You can say what you really think, you know, you're not going to hurt my feelings or anything. Everyone loves him because he's all laid back and approachable, but mostly he's just capricious and irresponsible. And then five years ago, he just, Melissa? Never mind. Yeah, he's just up and left. He just entered early retirement. You know, he's probably like 60, if not older. Let's get going. As soon as he's ready, we're heading back to the settlement. All right. Let's wait for him by the garage. Again, another misunderstanding on Alyssa's part. Lazy and capricious, you say. Guys... Should we head back to the settlement then? Hey guys, you're on pretty good terms with my grandfather then. Something like that. We've only known him for a couple of years, but all of us in the settlement owe him a lot. Myself included. Ah. Okay, we're good to go. You mind if I ride with one of you? Grandfather? You aren't driving. No, the inch has been acting up a bit lately, so I'd rather not. Besides, how can I pass up a chance to get to know my granddaughter's classmates a little better? Green, right? Got room for one more up there? Oh yeah, hell yeah. I feel like guys would be the better option, but it's whatever. Why do you have to pick Reen? What was that? You better not be giving him any funny ideas. <laughs> I'm sure that isn't the case. I feel a bit more at ease if you focus more on the reins, though. How's the little Sharon doing these days? I heard you recently started working at your dormitory. That's right, I haven't had too much time to get to know her. But she seems really skilled at what she does. Well, she is very much so. But more importantly, she's really cute. She always has that lovely reserved air, but there's a playful side to her too. I wish she'd sign them as my personal maid. That'd be the life. <laughs> yeah? But that Emma girl is really nice too. She's got those glasses, that hair you want, you want to let down. <laughs> And she's a class press material to boot. There's a smoldering homeroom hottie if I ever saw one. Come on, you know you agree with me. <laughs> well, I can't really say that I disagree with you. But if you don't mind my asking, why did you never tell Issa that you were here? Hmm. Tell me, Rain. What kind of girl do you see her as? Um. Well, 
I say she's a real hard worker in a great many respects. But I have no doubt of it. She's good looking, polite as well, mannered as any noble's daughter, intelligent. And that all comes naturally to her. It's not some persona she forces on herself. Yeah, I'm amazed at how effortless she makes it all seem. And yet, she has a habit of trying to resolve everything without relying on anyone else for support. I'm sure it hasn't escaped the nose of a candy young man like yourself. It does feel like that sometimes, yeah. She's kind and her sense of duty comes to her, com compels to her, compels her to always see things through. But she always keeps everything bottled up like she never wants to let on to anyone that she needs help with the problem. I'm Melissa R from Roar. It's not like I'm trying to make it a big deal or anything. It's just if everyone knew it would make things awkward between us and I don't want that. I have a feeling the relationship between her mother and I caused her to end up that way. And more specific, the conflict between the two of us. Mm -hmm. That's why I didn't tell her where I was, but I'll leave it up to her to fill in the details about that. I'm sure that once the two of you are a bit closer, she'll tell you on her own. A bit closer, I, uh, I have a feeling there's a critical misunderstanding going on here. Oh, is that so? I thought there was a little something going on between you two after seeing your name come up in all one of her letters. <laughs> in all one of her letters! Well, we did have that unfortunate accident back at the start of the year. That's all it was. We eventually got it sorted, and uh, nothing really happened since. An accident, eh? You accidentally collide with her on your way to school, causing her to drop the toast she had between her sweet lips? And as the dust cleared, did the two of you find yourself sprawled on the ground in an unlikely yet heart-wasting position? Anime cliche. That's a really oddly specific question. But I don't know what kind of heart-racing position you're... Hmm. So I don't know what kind of heart-racing position you're... Hmm. <laughs> so something really did happen, didn't it? I'll just tell old Grant here all about it. I want every last juicy detail. Nigga, we're talking about your granddaughter here. Sir, it's like we're not talking about the maid. <laughs> Skirt! <laughs> Grandfather, please! Oh, we've been caught! Hey, isn't that? Hey, isn't that? Who? What you doing out here, old Ooh, little it's girl? Those military academy students. I wonder yes. what they're doing all the way out here. Robbing niggas. Heisting trains. Oh well. <laughs> Looks like things are gonna start getting interesting. Don't you start shit with us. <laughs> Silver object. All right, you know what is a bit different. Okay, let's get nope, this no, mission the started. Same. There's this face. Sheesh, Gramps and the others can be so unreasonable sometimes. I wonder is Gramps Grin? Are they working together? Or are these your friends he's talking about? Is that what happened? Did he go in the lake to talk to her? Also, I never found out. I was supposed to be looking into that manga, but with the uh, robot, it looks like that. But I forgot. I just I forgot all about it. And what, so I saw it again. I was like, oh yeah! That night, the people of the settlement held a banquet at the elder's house for us and Gwen. We're gonna get to here. Like, comment, subscribe, check out my social media links. Tell me what episode you enjoyed. Deuces, Slipbox Mafia. You watch the gamers out. Peace.